everybody, welcome back to another video here on Deca City. Uh, today I'm just going to kind of do some gameplay, some exploring, kind of see what's working and what's not working, and do some exploration, and kill some mobs, get some loot, things like that, and hopefully uh, make it out to the village outpost and get a bad omen so I can get some achievements. Oh, we got an intruder. We got a zombie down here. Oh, and oh, we got a skelly. Oh, he got me. Oh, he's a tough one. Uh, is he? Oh, he got me again. Wow. He was good on his aim. We don't need any rotten flesh. I have tons of that. Okay, let's go over here. I want to show you guys uh, something that I recently finished. Well, it's not finished, but it's still a work in progress. But something that I've made some progress on. So, you know how you have your standard mini map, uh, which has been expounded uh, with the cartographer's table? But I've made this giant map wall, and that way you can see some more close-up details on my world. Oh, got a phantom up there, dying in the sunlight. Oh, well, didn't get the experience for that one, but that's okay. There's plenty more where that came from. So this kind of gives you an outline of my world so far. Got Heart Lake City over there, and et cetera, et cetera. Well, let's go over here. Let's see how my vine farm's doing. Haven't been in here in a little while. Oh, not too bad. We got some vines. Looks like I'm gonna need to get some more shears in here. Collect some vines here for the farm. Oh yeah. Okay, let's put these back. Yeah, those are almost broken. All right, we'll gather these, throw them in the farm. Alright, now we'll just let that grow back again. And there's my Herobrine statue. <laughs> Alright, let's take a... Let's take a flight and go see what's going on out here in the desert area a little bit, maybe. Maybe check out the modern city a little bit. Ooh, I know. Uh, since I've been having some issues with some redstone uh, devices not working properly, um, I haven't been over here in a while, so let's go check out my cow cooker farm. See what's going on here. Oh, looks like I only got one cow left. Uh, okay, well. Got a good amount of supplies in there, but it doesn't work if there's only one cow. And down here, nope, oh, looks like I've lost all my chickens. Because this used to be a chicken cooking farm. Or a chicken cooker. But, it Looks like uh, that won't be working for a while since I don't have any chickens. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, clear out these chests and... Because I have a, a lot of chests randomly throughout the world, so it's kind of good to find some of them and empty them so I can get the supplies going into the item sorter. So we'll just 
distribute uh, a bunch of this stuff into the shulker box and gather the rest of the items in here. Nice. Oh, got some wool in here. We'll take that too. Ooh, I don't know if I'm going to have enough room for all of this. those in there. Alright, uh, let's take that and that. Yeah, we'll leave those for now. Okay, I need some room for a shulker box, so I don't need, uh, I don't need this Danny line. Alright, now we got our items here. So this will be something that I will definitely have to come back and try to get working again. Alright, so let's head back to the main city and we'll just deposit these items into the sorting machine. And it's amazing to see how far my world's come so far over the the many years it's taken to, to work on this. Oh, looks like uh, <laughs> looks like the city doesn't want to load in. <laughs> you can kind of see the the inner workings of the world. Got a bunch of lava patches down there. <laughs> Can't really see where I'm going. <laughs> oh, there we go. Now it's loading in. There's a lot of stuff that I gotta work on in this world. Still gotta finish some of the sidewalks and put some more farms in that building. Alright. Yay! We made it to the item sorter. Alright, let's deposit our inventory into here. Lots of stuff. Okay, so, and then let's see what all I want to get rid of in the shulker box. Okay, so I want to keep my redstone stuff. Alright, yeah, I want to keep all that. So let's put the rest into the sorter. Alright, that definitely cleared up some space. Okay, let's take our sugar box here. Alright, and let's eat some food. <laughs> we don't want to starve. Let's check out the market. See if they got any good deals. See if we made any money. Uh, nope, we are totally broke. That's my secret uh, passcode for the locking door. And then we got our little bathroom in here. Well, it looks like they don't have very many good deals today, so I guess we'll skip the market for today. <laughs> oh, I hear a spider. Alright, so 
said, let's go. Oh yeah. So we made it to the outpost. It took a very long flight to get over here. Now I was trying to work on an automatic pillage killer machine basically, but I don't think it's actually working. But let's do some constructing and see if we can make this work a little bit better. Kind of fill in some areas. Alright, uh, let's see here. Add a couple blocks here. Maybe if I make it dark enough, it will get the uh, mobs to spawn through there? I don't know. This is supposed to be an elevator that's supposed to push them up to the top. But maybe if I enclose this, maybe it'll push them through and they'll fall down into the death trap. I'm not sure. But uh, we'll find out if it works or not. Oh, oh, ouch. That hurt. Oh, it looks like the phantoms are out. Those things are sneaky. Oh, first shot. Oh, oh, crap. Oh yeah. I gotta be aware of my surroundings. Ooh, wow. That was a good shot from the way back here. Alright, we're getting surrounded by mobs. Let's see if we can get this creeper. Yeah! Nice. Okay. So, back to what I was doing. Let's go up here. Okay, let's continue. Trying to see if we can get uh, this mob grinder to work. If not, I might just have to do it the old fashioned way and. Oh, and. Didn't mean to do that. I didn't know it was going to break both signs. Okay. Well, we'll just put a sign here. And. How about up here? Why not? Yeah, let's do the side. Okay, that'll keep the water from going all the way over. Because what that's supposed to do is push the mobs over the edge so that they will fall to their doom. But it doesn't do anything if the mobs aren't spawning in the machine. So we're going to try a couple more things here and if it doesn't work then I guess I'll just take it down and just do it the old-fashioned way and just attack the mobs <laughs> until I can figure out a uh, better way of getting this to work actually what I should do is go into creative and see if I can get it to work and then come back into survival and 
build it that way. But for right now, since we're in survival anyways, I'm just gonna do what I'm gonna do here. And that way we can kill some mobs while we're at it. Nope, I didn't get him. Oh, nope. He's too fast for me. Oh, oh, I got him. Oh, he's on fire. <laughs> oh, look at him run. That was awesome. Yeah, make sure that there's no phantoms flying around over me. Those things are sneaky. It always makes me jump whenever I'm not ready for it and they come up behind me and attack me oh it makes me jump <laughs> okay so let's see so the mobs are supposed to fall down right there okay so I need to have some hoppers in there that lead to a chest, so if they do fall down, I can get some loot. So hopefully it'll go into this chest. Uh, we'll just we'll just break this glass right here. Oh, I don't have a silk touch. Okay, so we'll just have to break it. We'll just replace it with a a block. Okay, so we've got our hoppers, so they should land on that and die, and the loot should go into the chest. Fingers crossed. But, okay, so I'm going to build this up and see what I can get going here. Let's see if this works. Nope, I hit the top. Oh, no, I'm not even at the top. I'm halfway there. <laughs> oh, man. I hope this works, because otherwise this is going to be disappointing. I wonder if I enclose this area, if it'll help? Or... I guess we'll find out. Okay, so maybe if we if I put a block here and here, maybe that'll help uh, keep them contained. Or maybe uh, let's see here. Oh yeah, I gotta do this side first. So let's go down here. Dun, dun, dun. Flying is the best way to go. Best way to travel in here now. Oh, there's some scaffolding. Don't want that to go to waste. Okay, let's build up this side. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can get this right. I'm jumping without placing blocks. That was genius. Alright. Oh, hit, hit the center again. Oh, there's the shulker box. Alright, clear that out of the way. Maybe, um, if I figure out how to get this to work, maybe I can actually get, a, do a tutorial on it. Because uh, with the, the new pillagers, I think it'll be a great farm to have because they drop emeralds and enchanted weapons and tools. So that would be something to, good to have. Alright, so let's fly down here. And I overshot my landing. So, ooh! XP beads! Yay! Ooh, ooh, whoa, 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 oh, pillager, pillager, oh, and a skelly, and a skelly. 
There we go. Okay, so... Let's fight off some mobs here. Okay, we got our entry point to the outpost. And let's go up here to where the elevator is supposed to start. Because it's supposed to push the mobs down and into the elevator to push them up to the top. But obviously that is not working. Because for some reason they are not spawning in the location that they're supposed to be spawning. But let's go see what this uh, traveling villager has to offer us. I'm surprised he's even over here in this dangerous area. Eh, nothing good. So, no trading with him, plus I don't have any emeralds on me. <laughs> Goodbye, zombie. Okay, so let's go up here where the pillagers are supposed to... Ooh, we got a skelly. We got a skelly. Uh, da -da -da. Oh, it would help if I uh, pulled the right trigger <laughs> so I could actually shoot an arrow. Okay. So, inside this box, they are supposed to spawn in between the glass, and they are not spawning. So, if I go a further distance away, I probably didn't go far enough, but let's go up high, and See if we can get any of them to spawn. Probably not. I don't see any mobs coming through the elevator. Well, maybe I just didn't give it enough time. Well, it's been like this for a while. Um, that's where the elevator is. Let's go back over here to the other side here. Okay, so the mobs are supposed to spawn inside there. But nothing's happening. I think I have a broken machine. Well, let's see if we can get this creeper. Oh, oh I got him! Oh, that was awesome. Ooh, I got a spider too. Oh yeah. Time to collect some loot. Oh, gunpowder. Gunpowder's good to have. I hear a spider, but I'm not seeing. Well, let's just oh, uh, jump right into the water. <laughs> uh, that was not a very good launch. All right, let's just go up here. <laughs> All right, let's see. Don't even know what time it is, so... I don't think it's, it might be almost close to time to getting dark, but not yet. So this is the village. This is a really cool village, actually. It's up on uh, different pillars, and it's just awesome looking. So I don't think I could have asked for a better village to be next to an outpost. And then we got a giant gravel pit. If you need gravel, there's plenty of it right there. And, oh, uh, undershot. Okay, so, since this part's not working, let's just, uh, 
Let's just cut through here. Let's go to the top. Yeah, because that's where they're supposed to spawn. But since it's not working, let's just do this the old fashioned way. Oops, I uh, broke into the elevator. We don't need water everywhere. <laughs> so let's just close this back up. There we go. Okay, so. Uh, let's see, what do I need? Uh, what am I looking for? I think I'm looking for... Oh, yep. I do have some glass panes. Okay. So, since I don't have silk touch, uh, we're just gonna break the glass here. We'll clear this out. And so what I'm gonna do is, instead of having a... area that's enclosed, I'm just going to use the glass panes to trap the pillagers. So we're just going to forget the elevator thing for now and until I can figure out how to get it to work, right now we're just going to put it in disable mode. <laughs> So let's fill in the floor. Actually, let me grab some of this. Alright, so we're gonna do this in between the posts. Okay, and yeah, I wanna fill this in. Bring the panes out this way. Because where that uh, oak plank is sitting, that's where they're supposed to spawn. So we kind of have. Oh, I might have glass panes. So at least we got the area covered that they're supposed to spawn. So they should get trapped in the glass panes. So what I'm going to do now is uh, clear out some space here. go up to the top really quick yeah I don't know but anyways uh, so I finally got what I wanted to do and that was to get a bad omen so coming up next will be the village raid so stay tuned and I hope you guys enjoy oh, 